Today on Happiest Camper, I'm going to show you how to make a microwave bowl cozy. You will need to use 100% cotton for the fabric, batting, and thread. If you do not use 100% cotton, you run the risk of the fabric or thread catching fire in the microwave. Measure and cut out your fabric and batting. You will need the front and back fabric. This includes two squares of 100% cotton. To make your bowl cozy the same size as my example, you will need to cut them into 10 inch squares. You can adjust the size of your squares as well as your darts to match the size of your specific bowl. You can use two different fabrics to make your cozy reversible or have two squares of the same fabric. Whatever you choose will be great. When you measure and cut your 100% cotton batting for the bowl cozy, cut it so it is slightly smaller. I cut a 9.5 inch square of batting for my 10 inch square fabric. Lay one cotton square face down. Place one batting square on top of the cotton square. Be sure to center it. Pin twice on each edge to hold the batting square in place. Next, use a light colored pen and ruler, draw lines connecting opposite corners on the batting. This will create an X on your square. Stitch across the squares diagonally along the lines you drew. Repeat steps three through six for the other square of fabric and batting. Fold one square in half with the right sides touching. Measure and mark three quarters of an inch down from the fold on the raw edge of the square. On the same corner, measure and mark two inches in from the edge. Then, 
Connect your two marks with your ruler and light-colored pen. Now, you should have two diagonal lines along the top fold of your fabric. The next step in this microwave bowl cozy sewing tutorial is to stitch across both drawn lines. As I continue to show you how to make a microwave bowl cozy, you will need to open the fabric and fold in half in the opposite direction. Your freshly stitched lines will be in the middle of the square. Measure and mark lines with the same dimensions as step eight for each corner of the newly folded square. At this point, you will need to check to see if your bowl cozy will fit your bowl. If it is too loose, feel free to adjust your darts to make the bowl cozy tighter on the top or bottom of the bowl shape. Then, sew the darts you just drew. If your microwave bowl cozy is a perfect fit, go ahead and cut off the extra fabric on each dart. Repeat the last four steps for your other X sewn square. Place one bowl cozy inside the other, making sure that the right sides of the fabric are touching. Pin all the way around the edges of the bowl cozy. You need to be sure to line up the edges precisely. Be sure to leave a two and a half inch opening on one side for turning. Make sure this opening is not on a corner because it will be harder to close it later. Using a one quarter inch seam allowance, stitch around the edge of the bowl cozy. Next, trim off the corners, making sure not to cut through your stitches. Through the opening you left, turn the bowl cozy right side out. We are almost finished with our microwave bowl cozy. Push the fabric in along the opening, trying to keep the folds even with the seams you sewed. Press along the edges of the bowl cozy to make the fabric lay flatter.
Using just less than a 1 quarter inch seam allowance, top stitch around the edge of the entire bowl cozy. Be sure you catch the edges along the opening with your stitches. Now you have a wonderful microwave bowl cozy that will save your family's fingers from all those hot bowls coming out of the microwave. Be sure to like this video and subscribe to our channel so you don't miss out on all our great sewing content. We have lots of clothing sewing projects, bags, kitchen sewing projects, and other fun items you can make. Thanks for watching.